Scroll to the bottom of your Lit for Life course and look for Record Your Presentation. Open it. Then look in the upper right hand corner for Submit Assignment and choose Submit Assignment. A pop-up box will open. Under the Upload tab, which will automatically be selected, look for the microphone icon and choose it. You'll then be given two choices to choose a recording type, audio only or audio and video. Select audio and video. Schoology will prompt you and ask if you will give it permission to access the microphone and camera. Choose a lot. At this point, your video will start working and you'll be able to record yourself. You can see me talking in the video here. You wanna make sure that you're looking at the left side of your iPad because that's where the camera is and you can tell the difference when I'm looking at the camera like now versus when I'm not. It looks like I'm actually talking to you when I'm looking at the camera on the left side of the screen. But it's also really important to make sure that you can see yourself and that you can fit your entire bag presentation into the screen. You can have a partner hold your iPad and record the presentation or you can set down the iPad and prop it up like I'm going to do right here on a few books so that you can see everything while I record. So here it is on the books and I just wanna make sure that everything is visible in the screen. And obviously it would look a little bit more natural if I were holding it up and looking at it so that it were like a face-to-face -face conversation. That's what this will look like when I pick it up here now. That's nicer, but if you have to, you can prop it up. Just make sure that you fit all of you in and don't chop off your head and that you fit all of your bag in for the presentations. When you feel like you're ready, press the blue start recording button at the bottom and then your video will start recording. You'll see a, a count up timer and you'll see how much time your video is taking, how long it's taking you to record everything and you can record it following all the parameters. And when you're happy with it, you can go ahead and press the stop recording button there at the bottom and the recording will cease. Then it'll take a second for your video to load and you can preview it again by pressing the play button and watch it back to see if you're happy with the recording. If you like what you see, you can press the insert recording button at the bottom. Then you'll see video recording.webm appear in that upload box that we looked at earlier. And at this point, you can either get rid of it by clicking the X beside edit details, or you can click submit. If you're happy with it, press submit. If you want to get rid of it, press that X. And then choose remove. And you can start the whole process over again and re-record your video by clicking the microphone and going back through the same steps that I showed you earlier. But just keep in mind you have a limited amount of time and you want to make sure you get the presentation done according to the rubric that Mrs. Kellenberger has showed you. And when you're done, press that submit button.